All right, thanks, Greg. I'm here with Marlins closer, Brandon Kinsler. I'm walking around this camp. You got monsters here. Is this the Dolphins or, or, or the <laughs> Miami think, Marlins? I know these are uh, some really young, huge athletes. Yeah. I think uh, that's what uh, Jeter and everyone wanted to do, bring in some really good young athletes. And I think uh, that one talent like that shows up here, and these guys, you know, learn the major league way, and that talent's unbelievable. I mean, I'm, I'm definitely the smallest guy around yeah. here. Take me through, take me through like last year you were with the Cubs, veteran laden team. Why Marlins? Is it, I want to close? I take think the, the, the challenge, I like yeah. the challenge. Like Derek said today, he enjoyed the challenge of, you know, coming here. The challenge of helping the team turn the corner. Uh, I think I helped that maybe a little bit in Minnesota. We know we're in the worst team in baseball in 16 and 17. We made a good run. And you know, that was a lot of fun. It was good yeah. to see, you know, young guys and a team that was struggling make that turn. And I think with this organization, I mean, it's a tough division. It's going to be a tough yeah, task. It's going to be but a nightmare. I think pitching in games in this division, those wins are going to mean a lot. It's going to be huge for us and devastating for the other team. And I'm going to enjoy that. Take me through like, you got to get your work in. But I feel like you, like you said, you brought in here to kind of help with changing a culture. Kind of learn along the way. Just stay back a little bit, watch how guys work, make sure I get my work in. One, I got to make sure I do take care of myself. Yeah. And then I think slowly, you know, young guys will start asking questions. And I think that's what's starting to happen around here. Um, and I, I enjoy that a lot. I think uh, maybe in the afterlife, that's what I'll be doing. But um, a there's a pitching coach. Action. Yeah, yeah, mental coach maybe. Who knows? <laughs> <laughs> but I've been through so much in this game, where a lot of ups and downs, where I've had to overcome a lot for myself. To where I think I've learned a lot, and uh, I've learned a lot from a lot of guys that are, you know, done way more than I have in this game. So I've been lucky. And there's a lot of good young. The talent here is unbelievable. To where if these kids just make that turn mentally. You know, who knows what's going to happen. I think we're all talented here. It's just, you know, it's just a mental challenge up here. What's the big thing for you coming in? You've had so much success in the game already. You pitched in the highest stages, highest leverage. What do you work on to get ready? I think, one, just mechanically, you know, you always got to be mechanically sound. It's just a mental game. I always feel like, you know, I got to have something to prove, make sure I got to make this team. Anytime I'm comfortable, I feel like I get off to a bad start. And I think in this in this day and age, at my age, you gotta you gotta have good years every year. Otherwise, who knows what's gonna happen? I feel like every year I got something to prove, and I think winning games is gonna do that for us. Take me inside. The one thing I never did in my career was go sit in a bullpen during a game. I have no <laughs> idea the makeup of what goes on. Right. Take me inside that mindset. Is there a lot of chatter? And then when you're when your numbers called and you're breaking through, I mean, you're walking into buzzsaw situations right, right. at the time. Well, the first five innings is probably, you know, I don't know, these day and age, could be the second inning, who yeah, knows? Right. But usually the first four or five innings, you know, everyone's joking, having a good time, you know, just relax. And as soon as that fifth inning starts, you kind of sense what's happening in the game. And you'll, you'll feel it start to get a little quiet. Everyone just starts their routine, you know, everyone's locked. And as soon as your numbers call, it's kind of just, everything's just slowly turning. When I was younger, things were starting to turn a little yeah. fast. But I just, you start going through your mental process as you're warming up. You know, it's things you've already gone over during the day. We prepared, and um, it gets intense. You gotta love the call, though. You gotta enjoy it. All right, man. I hope you stay healthy. Thank Have you. Have a monster season. Brandon Kinsler just answered the hard-hitting questions. Here's Greg Amsinger with some layups for the Marlins.